The registration for COVID-19 vaccination in Quezon City has been halted temporarily due to limited supply. For details, Jen Kalimon reports to us live. Jen, good afternoon. Uh, could you give us the latest on this? Yes, Charles, Quezon City is seeing improvements on local uh, COVID-19 trend based on data. It temporarily halted its vaccination registration, though due to supply issues. Professors Guido David and Ranjit Rie of Doctor Research both said uh, cases in Quezon City is now on a downward trend. As of April 14, the city is among the lower ranking LGUs in terms of virus attack rate. There's also a negative 10.4% change or growth rate in fresh infections in the city. Aside from the previously implemented Enhanced Community Quarantine or ECQ, Okta Research also attributed the improvement in the continuous virus mitigation efforts of the LGU. As a form of innovation, they installed X-ray machines in HOPE facilities. They are also intensifying their testing capacity as they have signed an agreement with Red Cross for 8,000 tests a day. On vaccination, the LGU is facing manpower challenges due to high number of recipients. Mayor Joy Belmonte said they have partnered with various private organizations for additional staff. Aside from this, the supply is also limited, prompting them to suspend the registration. More than 332,000 people have registered via the EC Consult app. 229,000 are approved and 102,000 are pending. The DOH have allocated 13,000 Sinovac for 16,500 people in QC, but that's only good for a day. Meanwhile, the 1.1 million doses um, they ordered from AstraZeneca is expected to arrive in June or July. Charles, the Octa Research and Quezon City LGU both hope that the number of cases in Quezon City will continuously improve. The LGU is asking additional allocations from DOH for the vaccine supply to sustain their inoculation efforts. Charles? Thanks for that, Jen. That was Jen Kalimon reporting live from Malabon.